When looking for free online audio editors, I came across Twisted Wave. Twisted Wave, unfortunately, is only for Mac, but I wanted to go ahead and show it to you because I know a number of you guys do use Mac for your web editing. So let's take a look at it. I've got my file here. I'm going to just drag it onto my screen. And here it goes. Let's make this a little larger so those of you at home can see this. All right. As we learned in a previous movie, I've got some some blank space, some sound that needs to get needs to go away in this loop here at the very beginning and then here at the very end. So let's work on doing that. It can get a little tricky sometimes to get this guy to really work. So what I like to do instead of trying to fool around with it at this level is I want to zoom in. So let's select, select this much, go up to view and zoom to selection. You'll notice that the boxes down here did zoom in, but the box up here, that's showing you the overview. Now, click inside the boxes down, down at the bottom, and let's get rid of that much. Highlight it, delete. Okay, now I'm still zoomed in on just that one little part, so let's zoom out. Let's view the whole sound. This time we're going to do the opposite. Select on the other side. View, zoom to selection again, and let's take it from there to the end and delete. View, view whole sound again. Now, one of the things I did find that you could do with this particular editor online is you can copy and paste and paste to create a couple of loops. So let's do that. Hit Control or Command A, excuse me, Command A, because you guys are on Macintosh if you're watching this. Hit Command C, move your cursor to the very end, hit Control V. And you'll see it's pasted it, pasted it in there. So let's do that one more time. Control V. Great. Let's listen to it from the beginning. Let's view the whole sound. I'm going to go back to the top here. There we go. Hit play. There we go. That sounds like a pretty decently seamless loop for what we need. So go up to File, Download, and I'm going to change this from WAV audio to an MP3 and download that. That's great. Let's open this up. And I'm going to open this with QuickTime. There we go. Sounds great. So that was a little look at how to use Twisted Wave, an online free editor for Mac, to help create those seamless sound loops. I hope you, didn't, I hope you enjoyed it.